Mid-Year Submission, Reconciliation Reports This video demonstrates, which reports to extract to reconcile payments made to SARS with the payroll. To determine the liability of pay as you earn, skills development levy, unemployment insurance fund, and employment tax incentive, on the payroll for the submission period, the user extracts the EMP 501 report from the Classic Reports menu, Category Heading, Legislative. Should a difference be discovered when reconciling the payments made to SARS with the payroll, note the month in which the variance was found. In this example, a difference was discovered in June. This next video will demonstrate how the user exports the component variance report from the NextGen Reports menu per run. On Sheet 1, the user filters the components relevant to the tax that was paid to SARS. By doing so, the user can compare the tax per employee on this report to the component variance report that was exported during the June pay run. Once the employee record causing the difference has been allocated, the user filters the component variance report to display all the components relevant to the employee in the month the variance occurred. By doing so, the user can find the root cause, by comparing all items of the employee to the component variance report that was extracted during the June pay run. Kindly note, the possible reasons for having differences when reconciling payments made to SARS with the payroll.